Okay, let's try pressure. Can't have all day, right? You gotta make a sandwich on the go. People got busy lives. They need their peanut butter and sandwiches on the fly. Wait, wait for it. This is sanitary cardboard, by the way. Okay, slide in. Now watch this drive. Let's see what happened here. I got some successful cuts. I got them the flattening aspect, more pressure right. applied. Next thing we're gonna, gonna want to do, I'm gonna peel it off like that. I could have just cut it apart with a katana. I'm gonna do this now. So what we're gonna want to do next, haha, <laughs> you use a katana that time. You're gonna need a banana. Carefully. Then you're going to want to find a knife that's sharp enough to cut into a banana. But uh, until then, you're just going to give it some time. Be safe. Always cut towards the banana. Alright. Careful. This would be a bad time for this knife to suddenly get really sharp. Like, I know it's never going to happen, but like I, I'm like, what if this thing turned into a lightsaber? My fingers would be clean off. Okay. Now the greatest thing about a katana is it's got a natural curve in there, you see? A little tang. By the way, next episode, we're making tang. Stay tuned. <laughs> he collapsed. Alright, see? So you got this natural rocking motion. Look at that. Make it work for you. Let the blade do the work. Blade do the work. It's as easy as pie. It's as easy as wait for it. It's gonna be a good fucking joke. Yes, killing motion would be better. Oh, there's only a piece of banana. It's as easy as pie. Banana cream pie. There's still a bill piece tip. What you really want to do is if you want to avoid a soggy sandwich, you obviously put peanut butter on both sides of the bread first as a barrier so your bread doesn't get soggy. So that's what we're going to do first. You uh, get your peanut butter, you get your katana, and then you... peanut butter on a katana. Um... <laughs> Everything tastes better off a katana. Everything. People... Okay, now you're gonna want to spread it. Easy peasy, right? Want to keep the sharp edge away from your digits. Mmm. So good. So good. Alright. Yeah, we could use a little more on that side. If you're like me, you like hell of a butter on them sandwiches. You gotta bounce it when you spin it. Mm. There you go. Boom. Done. One side done. Next side. And they're actually two different sizes of bread, but that's okay, because one side is gonna be on top anyways. Alright, here we go. More butter. Good. When I drop this to cut my hand clean off, this video is gonna get a million views, and I've got health insurance, so I'm good. Here we go. Okay. Now this bread is slightly bigger and has a hole in it, which poses its own unique set of problems, but for a competent blade chef like me, by the way, I'm the only person on the planet Earth who's ever called themselves a blade chef today. Okay, keep it going. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Hieroglyphics, hieroglyphics, keep it going. Alright, you know what? I think for this side... 
that's, uh, that's what we're going to do. Alright, can I get a good view on that bread? <laughs> okay, now i got to get a good view of that bread. Okay, we got the bread. Let's see? Jelly. Sword. We're not monsters here. We're not going to always wipe the peanut butter off your katana before you cross-contaminate your ingredients because someone's going to come into your house. They're going to be like, awesome, strawberry jelly. Good thing I have this peanut allergy. And they're going to eat it and they're going to die. And uh, you're going to have a katana sitting there, so obviously you're going to be the prime suspect in that case. Okay. It smells clean. It's got a little bit of runny stuff on the top. So you're gonna, first of all, mix it up. There's no shame in, I think the blade is like peeling off pieces of the plastic. Anyway, it's working up good. Work it up. Work it up. Work it up. It's like shake it up, but it's work it up. Okay, shit. Shit. Oh, <laughs> nope. Well, there goes our presentation value. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is do this. Mmm. Plop it. Plop it on thusly. Wait. No, your katana is going to want to keep that sweet, sweet jelly juice on it. But what you can want to do slowly. Pretend like you're uncutting it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, God. I'm sorry, God, for what I'm doing right now. I know not what I do. Just kidding. I know exactly what I do. I make good ass peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Boom. Yeah, stab for good luck. And then look at this. We have bananas. How are we gonna get those bananas on the sandwich? Gross skin, gross skin, good banana pieces. Womp. Oh, yeah. Boom. <laughs> it's actually really gross. It's mostly half fructose corn syrup. Alrighty. Then, you just gotta put one slice on top of the other. Mmm. <laughs> and last but not least, you're gonna wanna cut that back in half for proper serving technique. Mmm. 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 And there you have a peanut butter jelly. Oh. Oh. And banana sandwich. And you're just gonna wanna do a last cut, get to that bottom piece. You know that last piece that you just can't. It's just ruining everything. And there you have peanut butter, jelly, and banana sandwich. Thank you.